Since the dawn of the Internet and the very first browser, we've been accustomed to bookmarking our favorite content. First, we simply bookmarked interesting places we wanted to keep a record of in our browsers. If we were organized, we used folders to categorize them. Well over a decade later, we're introduced to the age of social computing, encouraged to share and collaborate. So we begin to share our bookmarks in the public domain with services like Delicious. Instead of storing the bookmarks in folders, we tag them as we capture them. A tag is simply a word you use to describe a bookmark. Unlike folders, you make up tags when you need them, and you can use as many as you like. The result is a better way to organize your bookmarks and a great way to discover interesting things on the web bookmarked and tagged by users. Enterprise 2.0 is born when it becomes obvious that organizations can also benefit from social software. Cogence is born and offers organizations a private and secure space in which to allow their employees to bookmark and tag important content both on the web as well as behind their firewall on their corporate intranets. Cogence taps into the collective intelligence of an organization by collecting, sharing and connecting around unstructured information. Let's first have a look at how users collect and tag bookmarks. Let's assume I'm researching social software and look up its definition in Wikipedia. By clicking on the Post to Cogence button on my toolbar, Cogence pre-populates a posting form for me and it automatically includes the URL of the bookmark and its description. It then allows me to choose whether I want to keep this post private and allows me to dual post to my delicious account. This means that those delicious users out there won't have to worry about maintaining two bookmarking systems. Then I'm asked to tag the bookmark. I start by typing social. Cogence intelligently predicts what I may be looking for based on tags I've already used as well as tags others have used. And if this bookmark has already been tagged in the system by someone else, Cogence will also suggest I use those particular tags. I select Social Software, Social Media and Wikipedia as tags and I click Save. Cogence lets me go back to my browsing experience. At any time, I can click on the shortcut button to My Cogence. There, you will see all my items and the latest bookmark I've just posted. No doubt I've convinced you how easy bookmarking in Cogence actually is. User adoption of Cogence in organizations is high because we aren't asking the user to alter their existing behavior. Even if you aren't a delicious user, as long as your quick post buttons are installed, bookmarking becomes easy and the added benefits of doing this in a shared environment and being able to access them from anywhere easily convinces a user to bookmark in Cogence. Earlier I said that Cogence helps tap into the collective intelligence of an organization by collecting, sharing and connecting around unstructured information. Well, so far we've shown you how easy collecting the information is. Let's talk about sharing. If you go to the home page of Cogence, you'll see the most recent bookmarks posted by your colleagues, or you could change the view to the most popular items. You also have a view of the most active users in your organization, as well as the most popular tags. This is the simplest example of how Cogence allows employees to share their bookmarks and just navigating free allows you to learn a little more about the bookmarks and information sources your colleagues value. The real power of sharing becomes clear when you understand the value Cogence delivers around the connectedness of the bookmarks. 
Let's assume you want to build a business case in your organization on software as a service. Let's use the internal search function of Cogent to do a little research to find what people have been reading on SARS and perhaps work out if I can contact any of my colleagues in different practices or geographies who may already be experts in this area. By typing software in the search box, Cogent returns the search results and in the common tags area I can immediately see that someone has used SARS as a tag. Clicking on this tag shows me the list of bookmarks tagged SARS and also allows me to see the users who've been reading this material. By using my corporate intranet I can find how to get hold of Adrian Melrose who seems to have an interest in SARS. As time goes on and your organization collects and tags more data, Cogency's connectedness algorithm delivers meaningful search results connecting bookmarks by inferring connections between people, tags and bookmarks themselves. Talking about getting bookmarks into the system, Cogency allows you to import your most recent 100 delicious bookmarks so getting some meaty bookmarks into the system in a flash also helps boost user adoption since users immediately see the value in collecting and sharing as their ability to connect to bookmarks and users is immediately apparent. Look how easy it is to import your delicious tags. Cogence also allows you to subscribe to RSS feeds on any page. Whether you want to subscribe to all the bookmarks that a specific user posts or subscribe to a feed linked to just a particular tag. For those who aren't into RSS feeds, there's an email subscription function that allows you to receive updates for particular searches that you want to keep track of either immediately, daily or weekly. Please visit Cogents.com where you can log into the demo site and have first-hand experience of what we've shown and have access to detailed demos showing you the functionality we have outlined. Welcome to Social Bookmarking for the Enterprise.